Now, if I take as abstract, is it accepted or not? Observe that. Observe that. Subtest the, sub the extensive test, the provided implementation only for M1. Only, only for M1. Now I'm taking abstract. Now I'm taking abstract, abstract right. Now, have a look once. Uh, happily, the code compiles fine. But the problem in this case is, you can't create object for test class. You can't create object for subtest class. Because, because both are abstract. Even you have M1 method. Sorry, you can't call. Then, what I have to go for? I have to go for sub-sub-test. Are you getting next level child class? Sub-sub-test, extends, extends, test. Okay? This person should compulsory provide implementation for M2 method. If he is not providing implementation, immediately compile time error we are going to get, sir. What is that error? So compulsory should provide implementation for M2 method. Then it is valid. Okay? Like, so parent class abstract methods, who is the responsible to provide implementation, sir? Child class is the responsible to provide implementation.